Hello everybody, welcome back to Zero News and as you see up top, these are like the main stuff that we're going to talk about and what we're going to go over on this stuff. So, this is, just to let you know, I record, I'm recording this 6-6-2020, almost midnight, but I want to get this out. And, well, actually I just want to let you know what's, what's up, okay? I'm not like... This is a disclaimer. This might take a while for me to legitimately complete and do because I might even do this like today, which is the 6th of June, or tomorrow, which is which is the 7th, or maybe the 8th, depending on how progress goes because tomorrow I got to do something. I might, I might like, I don't I don't want the word vlog, but I might like record it or some of that. I don't know, but I'm just gonna let you know you know what's up. Okay, this is just a, just a disclaimer. So let's get to the first topic. All right, like on the top of the screen, we're talking about Pride BLK event and the Survivor title. So first, let's talk about Pride. All right, Pride is coming real soon. I think I might do that show on the twentieth. Or 27th, I don't know. But the thing is with Pride is it, like the thing is like this, all right? It's just hear me out. The Pride show is gonna be a lot more, um, more, more creativity. It's like I might let people, you know, join in the show. There's no requirements other than you gotta be respectful. Like, like if you wanna be on the show, no hate speech. No hateful shit, no stereotypes, no no offensive shit. Simple as that, all right? So Pride 2 is going to be soon. I am thinking about... Well, you know what? I, I'm going to announce some names, all right? Who's going to be the Pride show? Well, the Zero Weight Championship will be on the line at the Pride show. So, of course, Pandora 99 is going to be there. Kano is going to be there. Aurora Rama is going to be there. Just some good wrestling, good wrestlers are across the um, Zero brand and maybe beyond Zero brand because I kind of want some people from CR, some people from other promotions, and one team. No, it was two teams. I don't know if I actually mentioned them before, but two teams. I don't know if they're. I don't know. If it, if if one of them are a whole team, but if they're a team, they're a team. The two teams that we got so far that is going to be on the prize show, hopefully, is Mar Rivers and Mike Baylor, aka Mike Rivers, the River Boys, <laughs> against well, I mean not against because I haven't booked this yet, but I might put them against Royal Flush from WCC from other promotion like like Fire Pro Online. Royal Flush going to be there. If, and if you want to be a part of the Pride show, please let me know, cause I would schedule you. I will put you on, in a match, maybe by random, or maybe just throw you in a Pride Rumble, because I just want to do a Pride Rumble, cause cause I know I probably won't be able to get everybody in a match. So the Pride Rumble is like the extra match that you know let everybody come in, get their shit in, get their bumps in, entertain the fans, and be fun. The Pride Rumble, I literally thought about whoever wins the Pride Rumble, not only bragging rights, but maybe you get a championship shot. I don't know. I'm still thinking about it. Maybe a cup, like a tournament cup. That's probably shitty. But anyways, <laughs> I might, like, I really want the Pride event to actually be one of the most successful events and the funnest events. I don't want nobody to feel like this shit is all about the LGBT. No. Pride is about you being yourself. You love what you love. It's kind of LGBT, it's kind of LGBT thing, but for me, it's more about love. So I decided to do LGBT mixed with wrestling mixed with being yourself you get this i know it's rainbow because the pride thing's rainbow so it's all about love my guy it's all about love you know 
So I think that's all I gotta say about Pride Two. So, but matter of fact, we still looking to into some things we might put in the show. Cause I want a variety of matches, not just same old singles matches, tag matches. I want some to be to like you know make things more interesting. Can't do a fucking ladder match because it's Fire Pro, but you know, yeah. So next to our next topic. Oh god, okay, this should be good. Next, we're gonna talk about some that is very dear to my heart. Next to Pride, Pride is also dear to my heart, but this one. I just want to make things more like accepting. The Pride Show is about acceptance and all that stuff and love, wrestling and you know all that. But I don't want to sound like I'm exploiting this shit that's going on in the real world with just my wrestling and shit, but part of me wanted to do a BOK show. Or black show. What it is like? I'm not gonna advertise me as this, you know, Black Lives Matter shit, cause that's is in another thing. Cause Black Lives Matter, I don't care what anybody say. I just want to do something, you know, that I like. I like wrestling. I'm black. Why not just put both together? Like my thing is like this. All right. The name Twisted Skill wasn't my idea name my other name was going to be something else but i don't want it to make it more controversial so a good friend of mine cedric gave me a name to the skill i said i said that was tough but the thing is this right i'm not saying that i'm not this this is probably going to be the name for now on but this show this is going to be a black show. African American show, Haitian, Jamaican. If you're black, you're black. People don't like black people anymore, apparently, especially them fucking pigs. So, we're going to give y'all, give the African Americans some love, you know. Nobody ever did an all black wrestling show or, or event in Fire Pro, that's what I'm saying. In, in E Fit Lands, that's what I'm saying. So, this is something I want to do. I really want to do this show. Look, I will talk about the whole Black Lives Matter thing in separate time. Because I, I, cause that, I just need to let my emotions go. So let's talk about something else before I get fucking fucked up by this shit. This might be strange to y'all, but we're going to talk about the um, Survivor Belt, alright? If y'all watch the Tournament of Survivors, we have actually crowned a Survivor Champion. Or just a Survivor. Which is kind of edgy, though. <clears throat> but the But the winner of the tournament was Dicer. Dicer came out with the victory. And then exploded and died. We're not well. He's not really dead. I just said died to be more exaggerated. But like you saw the tournament, Dicer won the tournament, and he's a survivor champion, or just a, or just a survivor. But what is the survivor title? I'm gonna answer that with you, okay? The survivor title is a championship. Okay. Okay. It's a championship. For deathmatch, you know deathmatch. You know, I mean, some feds got their hardcore titles or deathmatch titles, but they, but the name itself, it's just kind of not original. More. I'm not gonna shit on other, you know, promotions how they treat the title. This title right here, the the Survivor Championship. I don't want to be cliche and say it's it's the most prestigious title because it's because it's basically a title of deathmatch. How we going to work this title is like this, all right? It's going to be like the Zero Weight Championship where it could go from fed to fed and all that shit, but, but you still the Zero Weight Champion, which means you're 
the champion of this brand. The Survivor title might be the same way. Title of the brand. And no, we're not going to have a world title called the Zero title. I need to blacklist that shit. But, um... But the Survivor title is a deathmatch title, so of course it's going to be only contestant deathmatch. The The idea I had was to have our own hardcore show, like I tried twice, and I keep failing, but what can you do, man? A guy like me has a lot of fucking ideas, and I want to do all of them at the same damn time, which is going to cost me my damn sanity. Yeah, that's truth be told, okay? So, this title is going to be a deathmatch title that's going to be defended in deathmatch matches. Either it's, a, either it's the Cajun death, the Bob Wire of death, I wish I call it Charlotte's Web. I'm going to start... That's a good name for for a hardcore pay per view, Charlotte's Web. Yeah, I'm gonna keep that. But <laughs> but it but it's gonna be um shit. Fuck, I forgot everything about this. I forgot the hell I was talking about. But um, basically, it's gonna be a death match title for any type of death match: cage of death, Bob wire death match, landmine board glass, Bob wire death match. Or fans bring weapons to match, glass match, and all the other extra shit. Like anything dealing with no DQ and fuck up people type matches. That's where the title is going to be defended as. But I got to make this clear, alright? I did mention that I did. I tried to make a deathmatch promotion twice and I keep failing. So something in me. One to try it a third time, even though it's a bad idea. So, here's here's what I'm gonna do. All right, I'm not gonna. I'm probably not gonna keep this up, but it's gonna be nice for y'all to, to listen to this shit. What's it gonna be? Is like this. Maybe every month. Maybe some random time. There's gonna be a, a survivor shows. Or I shall call it the extreme shows. These shows are straight deathmatch shows. Not weekly. Probably monthly. If I can remember. <laughs> and this title will be on the line every single time. It's not going to be... A hardcore 24-7 title? Hell no. Fuck that shit. It's going to be a straight up deathmatch title for their own deathmatch shows, which going to be monthly because if you think realistically, CZW does their shit monthly. BJW, I don't even fucking know, but them mental ass motherfuckers, man, I give them respect. Even though deathmatch can go too far and I don't like it. But anyways... Yeah, that's what the survivor title is gonna be like. That's what the, the that's what it's gonna mention. That's what's gonna be. That's what it's gonna do. Any questions? Drop below. If you wanna fight for the title, comments, comment, comment below. Like, god damn, man. But yeah, I think that's all the topics. I don't know. Let's check. So I thought about this little segment or little um thing I'm gonna do just because I got a lot of fucking ideas and shit that's so to the point that I don't even know if my sanity will even deal with this shit but um I thought about this thing called historic matches right so historic matches is a little thing okay it's basically like fuck it I might just say it now it's like New Exchange Wrestling Flashback, but it's not going to be about my current feds. It's going to be about my past, well, not my past feds, but probably 
probably introduce my past feds and um hmm. and some feds that I thought about. Let me explain, okay? Before y'all ridicule me, before y'all come fucking, before you come fucking with me, basically it's like this, all right? I got, this is real life shit, okay? I've been thinking a lot of feds. I've been thinking a lot of stuff. I've been thinking about my own lore. I've been like, like I'm, a, I'm a type of dude that likes to talk about present and the past. <laughs> what does that mean, man? What I mean is like this, okay? My past stuff, like when I like before I was introduced to Fire Pro and E fading, I I've been thinking about other feds like basically like feds that's like around the lore. For example, if it's like fuck <laughs> okay so sorry i was just thinking of something but like here's the thing okay basically when i was little i used to think about other feds like a fed called extreme a fed called paw a fed called chi a fed called smackdown wrestling don't fucking judge me okay <laughs> but yeah that's what it is okay that's that's what i was thinking about that's what i thought about so historic matches is gonna be my safe haven for me to, to for me to showcase my logos and some other shit like my like my fits inside my head, okay? Cause I know I can't do twenty fits at once on this damn channel, which is fucking crazy. But yeah, but you know it's just. Something I just feel like doing. Another thing that I also wanted to do is documentary. A fictional documentary, okay? I know I'm not I'm breaking the fourth wall and I'm breaking kayfabe, but it, I just want to get this out there so y'all can understand so it doesn't come out as me introducing another fed that's going to be a pow of feds on my channel. No. Here's, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. I'm going to work on one episode of the documentary that I want to do. What is the documentary about? I did talk about it on my last episode of Zero News. Basically what it is, it's like this, okay? My character, as you see on the screen, is going to interview other people. From my other feds inside my mind. The first episode I was, I was trying to do and trying to write the script for is about TWF, Total Wrestling, wait, Titans Wrestling Federation. But yeah, he runs Titans Feder Wrestling Federation. It's a small indie show that still that still runs in indie show levels, but it produced good stars as you see on, see today on the channel. That's what it is. Okay. That's what it is. So, the thing is like this, right? This episode is gonna be it's gonna take a while, but historic match is gonna be it's going think of it as like the armory, but with different arenas. And also, let me talk about the armory. The armory is just me to showcase future stars, give them you know bumps and shit. And yeah, that's uh, that's what the armory is. Okay, it's just, just like it's basically think of it as like an indie show that has no name. It doesn't make sense. I know. I'm sorry. I, I'm trying to make sense of everything, but I really can't right now. It's nearly midnight, so yeah. <sighs> Let's see. So that was zero news. That was the episode. And if you want to keep up with everything what's going on in Zero in my land of fucking weirdness, just, well, I don't got a Discord server because I really don't feel like making it to the server. But the one server you can go to is Triple Threat Promotion Server. Let's hope I remember to put the link down below. But I already got the link for the wrestling video game universe, you know? 
you know, their little Discord server. And three TP little newsletters. So support 3CP, support WVGU, support, support, support other fucking feds. Because in the land of Fire Pro, we selfish. So it's, it's kind of good if you just promote other people's work. If the 2K community can do that with commercials of other of, of other call feds, we can do the same with other fire pro feds. Let's not be too stingy, guys. So yeah, this was Zero News, Malik Demons. I catch you guys next time. I'm fucking tired. I'm gonna edit this tomorrow, since tomorrow's gonna be the fucking seventh. Jesus Christ.